Europe has again become the center of the pandemic as governments struggle to contain record coronavirus cases. The current situation prompts some European governments to consider reimposing a partial lockdown on unvaccinated citizens. In the Netherlands, the Dutch Prime Minister Mark Rutte announced at least three weeks of partial lockdown measures targeting restaurants, shops and sports events, making the Netherlands Western Europe's first country since the summer to take such decisions to curb a record spike in coronavirus infections. Tonight, we have a very unpleasant message. We concluded what we have talked about intensively over the past few days. It's just really complicated. It is inevitable that we will go back to measures that we knew from earlier phases. This affects us all, whether you are vaccinated or not. Denmark also reintroduced its COVID-19 health pass on Friday, citing the rise in cases. A green pass will be needed to enter certain venues or events and shows of proof of vaccination, a recent negative test or a recovery from coronavirus. Austria's government has imposed a new nationwide lockdown on people not fully vaccinated against the coronavirus or recently recovered from the disease. Unvaccinated people will only be allowed to leave homes for essential reasons such as working, shopping or taking a walk. As of tomorrow, every citizen, every person living in Austria must be aware that they can be checked by the police at any time. We will check if people have been checked if people have been vaccinated or recovered and the reason for entering public spaces. Germany and France are also experiencing a surge in infections, showing the challenge for government to tame the pandemic. Germany would also allow for measures such as compulsory face masks and social distancing in public spaces to continue to be enforced until next March. Europe is facing a sharp deterioration in the pandemic's situation especially in Germany and Central and Eastern Europe. Non-vaccinated people are the most affected. The World Health Organization warned Europe was once again at the epicenter of the pandemic. Cases and deaths have been raising there even as they largely fell around the world.